In this movie, we learn how to start as well as stop Cassandra. So in order to run Cassandra, we execute the Cassandra command that's in the bin subdirectory. Let's use cd space dot dot so that we have easy access to the bin directory. If we do an ls, we see that in the Apache Cassandra 2.0.7 directory, there is indeed a bin subdirectory. And if we were to look inside of there, we would see that there's a Cassandra command. In order to run Cassandra, we could do bin slash Cassandra. By entering that command, it's gonna go ahead and start up Cassandra. It's running in background mode. The other way to run Cassandra is in foreground mode. If you run in foreground mode, which we'll also do, it's a little easier to stop Cassandra. We're doing it the hard way first. So Cassandra is running in the background here. Let's say we wanna stop it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna open up a new terminal window. So we'll go up here to dash home, click on terminal. And in this new terminal window, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go find out the process ID for Cassandra. And we have to do this step because we chose to run Cassandra in background mode. PS space AUX space pipe space grep space CASS and hit enter. And if I scroll back up top here, we can see that the process ID, in my case, it's 4409. Yours will most likely be some other number. So what you need to do is simply take note of what that number is. And then back down at the bottom here, the command prompt, go ahead and do kill and then enter that process ID. So if we do that, that will go ahead and stop Cassandra. Let's now look at the slightly easier way, which is running it in foreground mode. Back on this other window, just to get back to the command prompt, I'm going to do a command C. If you're on a Windows computer, it's control C for you. So let's run Cassandra this time in foreground mode. So it's very similar, it's bin slash Cassandra. We just simply add a hyphen F at the end of this argument. Go ahead and hit enter. Everything's good. Because we chose to run it in foreground mode by putting in hyphen F at the end of our command, then to stop it, we can simply do a command C or control C on Windows inside of this window and that will go ahead and stop it. So if we do command C, it says announcing shutdown and sure enough, it's now shut down Cassandra. If we go back to our other window and we just wanna confirm this, if you hit an up arrow twice to go back to PSAUX grep cast and you hit enter, you see that there's no process ID. So it is indeed stopped. Let's go ahead and start it back up in foreground mode. We could do this from either window. We just need to make sure that we are inside of the Apache Cassandra 2.0.7 directory. So if we do an up arrow, I'm gonna go ahead and start it back up with bin slash Cassandra hyphen F.